Imagine standing on a vast plain, stretching endlessly in all directions. You look around, searching for an edge, a curve, a sign that the land bends or loops, but you see only horizon. This is the feeling cosmologists grapple with when they ask, what is the shape of the universe? Is it flat like an infinite plane, open like a saddle curving outward forever, or closed like the surface of a giant sphere where traveling far enough in one direction would eventually bring you back to where you started? The question isn't just poetic, it's fundamental. The shape of the universe determines its fate, whether it expands forever, slows and collapses, or balances on a cosmic knife's edge. To probe this, scientists look back in time to the afterglow of the Big Bang, the cosmic microwave background, CMB. This faint radiation, discovered in 1964, is like a baby picture of the universe frozen when it was just 380,000 years old. Tiny temperature fluctuations in the CMB carry clues about the geometry of space itself. If the universe is flat, parallel lines stay parallel and the angles of a triangle add up to 180 degrees. If it's open, space curves outward and triangles add to less than 180 degrees. If it's closed, space curves inward like Earth's surface and triangles exceed 180 degrees. Measurements of the CMB by satellites like WMAP and Planck suggest an almost perfectly flat universe with only the tiniest margin of error. But almost flat still leaves room for cosmic surprises. And here's the twist. We can only observe a portion of the cosmos, the observable universe limited by the speed of light and the 13.8 billion years since the Big Bang. Beyond that horizon, the universe might be infinite, or it might wrap around in ways we can't yet detect. Could it be like a video game map that loops seamlessly? Or is it an endless expanse we'll never fully chart? Despite decades of study, the true shape of the entire cosmos remains one of the biggest mysteries in cosmology. Every observation peels back another layer. But the ultimate answer, whether we live on a cosmic plane, a vast saddle, or a grand sphere, still waits beyond the edge of our current understanding.